Ex-war crimes fugitive Ratko Mladic has now been arraigned at the U.N. War Crimes Tribunal. It was his first appearance before the court, and CBS News correspondent Charlie Daggett is in London this morning with the latest on this. Charlie, good morning. Good morning to you, Jeff. The tribunal has now adjourned for a month so defense lawyers can study the charges against Mladic. He refused to enter a plea, but he told the court he defended his people, his country, and now he's defending himself. Ratko Mladic looked frail and his voice slurred when he identified himself as general when asked his name. General Ratko Mladic. His appearance was a far cry from the burly battlefield commander during the Bosnian War from 1992 to 1995. Mladic faces charges of genocide for the massacre of 8,000 Muslim men and boys in Srebrenica. The forces began the organized executions of the men and boys who had been separated and detained and those who had surrendered or had been captured. He's also accused of ordering the siege of Sarajevo, the brutal shelling and sniping of civilians. This resulted in the injury and death of thousands of civilians, including children and the elderly. Mladic refused to enter pleas for what he called obnoxious charges and monstrous words. He told the judge he's a gravely ill man. His lawyers say too ill to stand trial. His lawyers said he may have suffered two strokes and was treated for cancer in 2009, but doctors examined Mladic at The Hague, said he is fit to stand trial. It's adjourned until the 4th of July when he will be expected to enter a plea. Jeff? Charlie Daggett in London this morning. Charlie, thanks.